Hi, my name is Monica Burns, and I'm a webinar host for Simple K-12, an ed tech and curriculum consultant from New York, and founder of ClassTechTips.com. We're going to help you answer the question, how can I collect conference data? And we're talking specifically about student conferences today when you're meeting one-on-one -on -one with students and you want to keep track of all of their information. You might be used to collecting conference data on a piece of paper, on a clipboard, or in a binder, but I want to show you one of my favorite tools, Google Forms, that can help you collect and organize conference data. So here I am in my drive, drive.google.com, and I'm going to go to New, More, Google Forms. And so if you haven't played around with Google Forms recently, there are some new options and a new look um, in the new version of Google Forms. You can click this button down here and go back to the old Google Forms if you want, but we'll check out the new one together today. So every time you submit a Google Form, it puts data into a spreadsheet or into your responses that you can turn into a spreadsheet to find later. So every time you meet with a student, you're going to hit submit, 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 and put their information into a form and all the responses will go to one place. So let's make a form. We'll say that this is a writing conference form. The first question is going to be the name of the student I worked with, and that'll be a short answer. The next question will be the what we talked about. So the focus the focus for the conference, and this might be a longer amount of space. Um, and we'll add a new question here. It could be something like um, areas of need. So some areas where we're going to keep working more next. And then I'm done with my three quick questions of some things I might jot down during a, quest, during a conference student name, some things we talked about, the strategy we worked on, and some areas we're going to work on in the future. And of course, you'd customize that to what you're doing in your class. You can go up to the top and change the color. Maybe it's color-coded for different um, writing conferences, reading conferences, math conferences. And uh, when I go to send, I can send it to myself if I want to access it on my mobile device, but it's always right here in my Google Drive. And so we'll take a look here at the preview. Here's my writing conference form. And if I typed in the name of the student, what we talked about, um, we talked about paragraph formation, Something we still need help with is punctuation, and I hit submit. All the information goes in, and if I meet with another student, I can submit another response. So let's go back here to my writing conference. You can see that one response popped up, and that's the information from the conference. And if we go here to making a spreadsheet, it'll turn all of this information into a spreadsheet in my Google Drive too.